Okay, wonderful. So let's uh, try this one now. How many grams of B2H6 will react with three moles of O2? So uh, the equation is already balanced. Okay, you can tell by coefficients being in places and some not. Okay. Um, I'll tell you that you need to balance the equation if you need to balance it. If it's already balanced, I won't say you need to balance it. Okay? Or I'll, if it's already balanced, I won't say anything. Anyways, notice there's a 1 to 3 to 1 to 3 ratio of these uh, products and reactants. Okay? But we're looking for just BH2 and O2. So we know there's a 1 to 3 ratio of those two things, okay? So how many grams of B2H6 will react with 3 moles of O2? So first thing you want to write down is the number of moles of O2 is 3.00 moles. Okay. Or 3.00 moles of O2. So now we've got to figure out, well, what's the number of moles of B2H6? So in order to do that, we have to use this number and that ratio we were talking about, the 3 to 1 ratio. 3.00 moles O2 times, well, we're going to put moles of O2 at the bottom because we want to cancel that out. So for every 3 moles O2, there's 1 mole of B2H6. So when we cancel out moles of O2 like that, we will have, of course, the moles of B2H6. That's all we've got left over. So 3 times 1 divided by 3, that's going to be 1.00 moles of b 2 H6. Okay, now we've got moles of B2H6. Unfortunately, it asks for grams. Or fortunately, because we can take moles and convert it to grams using the molecular weight. Okay? First thing we got to do though is figure out well, what's the molecular weight of B2H6. So we've got two B's in it, right? And B is going to be 10. 0.81 grams per mole, and H, we have six of them, so 1.008 grams per mole. Now we just multiply those numbers and add them together, so we get 2 times 10.81 um, plus Six times one point oh eight. And for my molecular weight, I got twenty seven point six seven grams per mole. Okay. So all we gotta do to figure out the mass of B two H six is take 1.00 moles of B2H6. Now remember, we want to get rid of moles of B2H6 and get in grams. So in order to get rid of moles of H2, uh, B2H6, we've got to put moles of B2H6 down here. So for every one mole of B2H6, we have, it's going to be 27.67 grams. Okay. Cancel, cancel. We take 1 times 27.67. Of course, that equals 27.67 grams of B2. That's the answer.